Hello again, Dustin with Tango Down Customer Finishing. Just doing a quick product review. I recently got this rifle scabbard, and there's there's reviews on YouTube and online. However, all of them are really positive. Show the rifle slipping in and out, uh, and you know this didn't really work out the way I was hoping it would. And I just wanted to do a video on why it didn't. So if somebody's in my same situation wondering if this is going to work. They don't waste some money buying it and having to send it back. So this is the Tactical Rifle Scabbard by NC Star. It's listed on Amazon, where I got it from, exactly as VISM by NC Star Tactical Rifle Scabbard. And this is the tan version. It comes in a couple different colors. You know, I'm not going to go through everything. Like I said, other videos do that. Uh, as you can see... You know, it's your typical scabbard. It's got some nice features. It's got this opening here to let the mag protrude if you carry a rifle with a mag inside. This feature here, which I really liked for my specific rifle, uh, was to shorten it up depending on your barrel length. You don't need to have all that flapping out there. You can fold it up, snap it closed, you don't have all that extra excess material hanging loose came with these two molly straps uh, to attach it I guess to a backpack or a pack or something like that that's not what I was going to be using it for I won't get into what I needed it for and why but I was hoping to have something quick and sleek just to basically protect my rifle during transport and be able to utilize as a quick deployment device so as far as more reviews go I'll let you guys Go check out the other YouTube videos. I'm not going to waste your time and duplicate efforts. But I will show you this. This is my M4 short barrel. I got the Aimpoint PRO patrol ready rifle optic on there. Um, mounted on the flat top. And a 30 round magazine. If you like these, check out my other videos. Just a quick plug. Also, I got the Magpul grip and LaRue flip sights. But, however, my front sight is still fixed. That also becomes an issue. It's not a flip down sight in the front, and that causes some problems as well. Let me flip this over, get a better view on the camera. Alright, I'm going to start out just by laying this on. I'll take this off. Try to get some of these straps out of the way so you can see. As you can see, length is fine. Actually works out really good. I can fold it up and do all that. However, I got a front grip on here as well. Also, a light mounted to the side rail. This isn't a foldable front grip or anything like that. It's mounted right on the bottom rail. The light is separate, mounted on the side. You can see just by laying it on here, I got issues. This is where the rifle should sit based on the magazine and where this cutout is. If I slide it down enough to where my optic fits, let's see if you tilt this up a little bit, to where my optic fits, I got that far, but then you can see my front grip is a major issue. It, it just doesn't slide in. Um, let's say I didn't have the optic on there, it was up to about this point, it's still just a hair too much and you gotta remember this front sight adds a couple inches of height so even though the optics not on there I cannot slide this all the way up because the front sight hits and I mean and you can get into like tilting it and everything else but then it's just sitting weird in the scabbard and it's just not gonna feel right so Sorry for the shadows. Let me go ahead and try to put it in. I'll leave the optic on this time. You can see this is about... It's about as far as I'm getting. The optic isn't even an issue at first. It's the grip. You can see it won't even get past this little, this little hump here. So, and it won't get down. I mean, if you're comfortable with your rifle sitting like that, and, you know, you got issues. So... It's not really made to have all this stuff on it. It's 
made just basically for your stock M4. I'll go ahead and pop this off and show you that it doesn't fit as well. Again, let's try it. Remember that front sight gives me issues. This gets really close, but I still wasn't comfortable with it. I mean, I could force it up there. The front grip is hitting right there. I can feel it right there. It won't get past here. I mean, yeah, it works. Could you utilize this? Probably. However, I mean, you really want that skyward to come up to about the stock. I I don't know. I'm not really comfortable with it. I, I would like to see that magazine riding right up front. And then, I mean, I can't even get this strap over. This retention strap ain't going. That other strap I took off will go around here so that you'll be able to snap it down and secure it a little bit more. But it, it's not going to work for me. That, the front grip is the major issue. Obviously the optic is the major issue too. Um, and depending on what kind of optic you have, you might have some more slimline than I do. But it's still going to cause you a major issue. If you got standard M4 with actually a carry handle might even be an issue as well. Um, but if you got a flat top with some iron sights, 30 round mag and not much going on up front. Or if you have a front grip that folds. I'm sure you could probably get away with using it that way, but for me and for my purposes, it's not going to work. I'm going to have to send it back. Unfortunately, pay the shipping to send it back unless I can find somebody else to buy it, but I doubt it. So that's just a quick look at the VISM by NC Star Tactical Rifle Scabbard. I'm sorry. You know, like I said, check out the other videos online for for more reviews. I just wanted to actually put a rifle in there that that somebody somebody might actually have, you know, as opposed to just a stock M4 with a 16-inch barrel. Thanks for watching. Hope this was helpful. If you got any comments or anything, feel free to leave them. Or if you have a suggestion for something similar to this that you know fits my rig, that would be very helpful as well too because I'm looking for, for something small, light, and tactical without having to have a big case, um, but I have yet to find anything. Thanks for watching.